Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is John Hammond. Welcome back to another video, this time showcasing uh, the Kaizen. I think is how you pronounce it, the Kaizen CTF. Uh, this was a capture the flag competition that went on last week, uh, Friday. I think it was like November 18th or whatever day is a, is a Friday of last week. Um, there wasn't too many members of my team that was able to like particularly take a look at it. It was myself, uh, Sam, and David, so just not, not too many other guys. But we actually ended up doing really well. We actually came in second place. But it was a small competition, so it was designed just for, like, the state of Maryland, but if you wanted to play, you could play as, like, any other college or any other team that you uh, were playing up as a part of. You just needed an EDU domain to be able to register, so us being at the Coast Guard Academy, we were okay to jump in. Um, and we actually came in second place, although we weren't able to win any, any prizes because we're not from Maryland or anything like that. Um, regardless, it was a lot of fun, so I wanted to showcase some of it before um, they brought all the challenges down because they, they say they'll be up for the rest of the weekend so you can keep trying your hands at them. So, uh, I wanted to show off a couple of them. In this case, I'll start with the QR Nightmare one. So, this was a just a bunch of QR codes. It says, I hid the flag in the QR code and I don't remember which file it was in, so please let me find it. So, we're given this zip file, which we can go ahead and save. I'll just create a new one for Kaizen and save stuff in there. And then we'll get a terminal open so we can start to work on it. I'll cd into Kaizen, and there's our QR codes thing. I guess I'll make a directory for that QR nightmare. And now we can unzip this, which is straight up unzip. And we have a bunch of QR codes now in this QR codes directory. So they're all just a bunch of images of QR codes. And it's up to us now to go ahead and extract all of them and try to find which of them have a flag. So we just have to determine which one. So this isn't too difficult to do. Um, I go ahead and use ZBar image, which is a bar career that can work from the command line. So we can literally just like slap ZBar image star and it'll try and like extract everything. So let's do that. We can use ZBar image star. And it says, okay, lol, not the flag, keep trying, blah, blah, blah. And we see a couple of other things scroll by. Lol, not the flag, keep trying, blah, blah, blah. So now I'll do this one more time, but I'll just actually grep out the lol, not the flag, keep trying to see what else is in there because I see other things scrolling by, and I'm sure one of them is the flag, but there are just so many of these things. Um, we'll just do that again. And I'll grep out lol, not the flag. So it takes a little bit of time now because we don't see those lol not the flag things coming out. It looks like there were other kinds of barcodes in there, but hey, we see our flag just pop out. We get that Kaizen Python libraries are awesome. I don't know what the intended solution for this was. Maybe there's a Python library for uh, looking at QR codes. In fact, QR codes. Maybe 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 QR code or whatever it is, you can just try and uh, get some stuff out of it. But I think a Zbar image works just as well. It was just a command line utility, and I was just able to just dot star it, and then everything just goes, and we get our flag real quick. So you would be able to submit that, and it was 200 points. So really easy, just a simple simple challenge to get 200 points. So Cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, again, a really simple video. I'll try to show off some other interesting challenges, and uh, I'll get back to letting you do your thing. See you in a later video.